How strong is your chi? Is it weak? Is it strong? Is it as strong and powerful as a superhero? Well, let's find out. Welcome to the Prosperity Alchemist channel, and I'm David Wong, and we're going to show you how you can measure your chi and how you can measure your energy field around your body. So for many years, I've been searching for a way to prove that chi exists and to show people that chi is real. It can be measured, it can be duplicated, and then it can be uh, quantified, and it can also be repeat it okay so that's what science is science is based on those three criteria it has to be duplicatable repeatable and quantifiable so i've been doing a lot of research and finally i discovered uh, an invention by dr constantine korakov and he invented something called the gas discharge visualization technique and based on this technique you develop a camera that's able to take pictures of this energy that comes off from your body. So what I'm holding in my hand right now is called the GDB camera. It's called the gas discharge visualization camera. Okay, And what it does is it has a special lens inside. Special lens inside. That can, is a highly sensitive lens that can measure the, uh, and take a photo of the gas discharge from your fingertips. So our bodies are electromagnetic. We all know that now. Okay? And we have an electromagnetic field around our whole bodies. The strongest organ that has the biggest field is our heart. And, um, but it also surrounds our whole body. And we generate electromagnetism uh, throughout our organs, throughout the nervous system, through our bones, and through uh, every part of our body. So for some people that's weak, some people it's strong. So that's what we're measuring with this GDB camera. Now, whenever there's magnetism, it excites electrons surrounding whatever's around that electromagnetic um, uh, device. So the air around your fingers, especially, or any part of your body, will be excited and will have a different uh, energy. So what this ca camera does is you insert your fingers into, into the hole and place it onto the, onto the plate, onto the uh, lens, and it'll take pictures of the uh, energy around your fingertips. And why the fingertips? Well, according to Chinese medicine and Ayurvedic medicine, uh, if you cut your fingertip up into pie slices, each part of your fingertips will represent a different meridian, represent different organs in different parts of the chakra and so, and so on. So by measuring the energy that's coming out of each part of your fingers, taking a photo of that, and then extrapolating that onto a uh, diagram of your body. Now you can see exactly how strong that part of your aura is, how strong that part of your body is, whether it be an organ or a body part. So let me just show you. Okay, so here's what the software looks like. And for example, I'm going to just take a scan. So I do a full scan. And all you do is you start with your right thumb. I'm going to put it in, place the right thumb on the camera lens, and click scan. It's going to take a picture of that. Okay, and then I put in my next finger. It's hard to do it at the same time by doing this, holding the camera and pressing it, but here we go. Okay, so it took me less than a minute, and now I have a snapshot of all the um, energy that's coming out of my fingers. It automatically calculates uh, which is the orientation of the video, uh, of the finger, and we just click analyze, and it just does it all by itself. All right, so here's my photos. If I put in the wrong folder, I put in this lady's folder. So it has a lady's image, but yeah, this is my picture that I just took. So you can see um, it, it shows you the energy in joules, and it shows you the balance, and it shows you um, how the aura field looks like. So in the places that there's a gap, that means it's weak, and in places where it is um, bigger, that means it's got more energy coming out of there. And ideally, you want to have a very even and balanced and full uh, energy field. As you can see, each one of part of the field in your body is connected to the part of the finger. So you can see on the bottom there, it's the right middle finger, and that's connected to the liver, and it says right middle gallbladder. So each part part of the pie 
of your fingers corresponds to a part of your aura and part of your body's aura. So that's how they connect the images to the aura of the person. Okay, it's also chakra alignment. Right now it's 91% chakra alignment. It tells you exactly whether you're too yang or too yin. Ideally, you want to have really big, see, you want to have really big circles in the middle, aligned perfectly like that. That's the ideal. So it shows you your yin and yang balance. So they'll, um, based on the meridians, so it will calculate the energy from both sides of your meridians, from the heart, lungs, liver, spleen, kidneys, pericardium, small intestine, large intestine, gallbladder, stomach, triple warmer, yang bladder energy. And uh, this is from Chinese medicine and also from Ayurvedic medicine. And it'll show you uh, normal is green, and then when it's a little bit low, then it's, it's orange. So right now my stomach energy is a little bit low. It shows you an analysis of the emotional pressure, whether you're stressed out or whether you're calm. Right now I'm here, which is pretty normal. And um, your energy level is optimal, almost perfect. And left and right symmetry is not optimal, close to there. And the organs balance is optimal. Also associates your health status. So ideally, you want to have a round circle like this. And each one of these lines presents uh, those organs again. And the further out it goes, then that means that more energy is in that organ. The further in it is, then that means that's less energy. So ideally, you want to be optimal. You want to be right there. And this is not bad. It could be a lot better. But uh, some places where it's going into the orange is the place that you need to be more aware of. Also shows you your energy level reserve. So how much energy is in your batteries um, and how much optimal energy. Optimally, you want to have that. And right now I'm at 59%. Okay, so let me show you a scan I did for a friend. So this is for, for someone that um, has, uh, so you can see that she was having some, a lot of gaps in her energy field. And she's someone that had a shoulder injury. So you can see that the shoulder has less energy. Okay, and you can see that it's a weak in some areas. So 33 uh, joules of energy and 80, 85% balance. Here's her chakras. You can see her chakras are small. So that means there's not much energy coming out from them. But her alignment's okay, it's 94%. Uh, yin yang balance, a little bit more yang than yin, but you can some, see her kidneys and bladder are a little bit weak. Analysis, you can see she's a little bit stressed out. So we need to get that down to uh, to optimal, uh, energy is low, and symmetry is low, and then organs are okay. Uh, but what's alarming is her health status is very weak. You can see that all her organs are almost in, are all in the orange area for the left and the right. So that's something that you should work on. And, and even more alarming is her energy reserve at 0%. So all these things she confirmed, she says that she's like, um, that's exactly what she's feeling. But now we can show it on a uh, report and show exactly what needs to be worked on and what needs to be uh, addressed. Okay, so what happened was uh, we did a um, session with uh, our technology it's called the Life Force Harmonizer. And uh, just for five minutes, and she was just, you know, just relax, lie down in between the devices. And after that, we did another test just uh, five minutes later. And look what happened to her energy level. So actually we can compare the two. Let me select these. And we're going to go and click compare. And then we go compare and we compare. Okay. So look what happened. We did a treatment. I think it wasn't it wasn't longer than 10 minutes. And look at her energy field. She had 33 joules of energy, went up to 42. The balance went from 85 to 91. And you can visually see that her energy level went up after the treatment. Okay, this energy field to compare the two. See, it was it was weaker and now a lot stronger. Okay, her chakras gained energy. You can see her heart chakra was very really small and now became a lot bigger. Her uh, base chakra, so all her chakras became bigger. 
uh, except the this one here. Okay, so alignment is less is because we are charging her with energy. So usually the alignment gets a little bit off, but most importantly is that the energy and the size of the chakras uh, grew significantly after the treatment. Well, look at this. She went from a stress level, okay, right down to almost optimal level. Okay, so she's at optimal emotional pressure. Her energy went up from lower to almost at the low optimal level. Her symmetry went from 85, which is uh, low up to a, up to an optimal level. And her organs balance went up to an almost perfectly optimal level. Okay, and remember this is just by five minutes. And then people that use this camera and they do their own training, it takes, it takes weeks of, of um, meditation. It takes weeks of training to get uh, this kind of results, to get this kind of results, okay? To get this kind of results, this dramatic, and then with our technology that I've developed, it took 10 minutes. Okay, so this is quite amazing how much, how much uh, this really works. And then, you know, now I can show people, you can see visually and graphically exactly how, how it's improved the person's status. So you can see this is before and this is after. Look, the energy levels are almost close to optimal or a lot better. They're still in the orange, but look at before. They're almost in the red, in between the red and orange. And now all of them are some even, even touching the green levels. Okay, and look at our energy reserve. Unfortunately, it's still at zero, but they're a lot better than before. You can see before it's a lot smaller. Now it's actually starting to come up into the green level. And that's when you can get actually positive. Right now, it's uh, still, net, still zero is because it's still in the orange area. But you can see, still see that it's a lot bigger than before. Okay, balance. You can see the energy levels go up a lot more. And if you want to drill down to exactly what finger, what the fingers, uh, photos are, you can do this. So what it does, if you look at here, is pretty interesting, is if you can look at the, um, so that's the actual photo that's being taken with the device on, on that lens. So it takes this photo, then it converts it into a graphic so you can see it clearly. And you can add the contrast to see a little bit better. And you can see the shape and the outline of it if you want. It shows you a spectrum of the analysis of the intensity spectrum with pixel count and all that. Also has a um, has a measurement of the ISO line. I'm not sure what that is, okay, but that's what it has in there. And it shows you which parts of the systems need more attention. Okay, so this is really dramatic here. So left energy went from here up to here, front energy went up, right energy went up, chakras alignment went down. That's normal whenever there's increase of energy. The chakras kind of get out of whack because you're moving so much. You're moving that energy so much. So I just showed you how to know if you have strong chi, strong energy field, or weak chi. Well, by measuring the electromagnetic energy from your fingertips and taking a picture of it with this device called the GDV camera. Now, how do you know if you have superhuman abilities? Actually, there's been studies using this camera of people who do, that do have psychic abilities, and it's amazing is that their energy fields look very different from people, from normal people. It, they have different um, patterns like trees or halos around their energy field. So this is very interesting of people who have altered conscious states that um, show up on this camera, their fields are completely different. They look totally different from normal people. So if you have superhuman abilities, maybe now you can confirm that with this technology. All right, so I'm Prosperity Alchemist, David Wong. You probably have a ton of questions. If you're interested in getting this camera, uh, my friend distributes them. You can just click on the link on this video and you can get this camera. You can ask him all about it. Uh, all about it. He's a researcher and a scientist also. So make sure you comment, like, or subscribe to this channel and to learn more of this technology, how you can measure it, and also learn about the technology that I've developed that help you to um, basically increase your life force in a matter of minutes using this technology that my friend, uh, we tested her and we treated her with this technology called a life force harmonizer. 
that you can use at home to boost your energy uh, in a matter of minutes, to align your chakras and to um, uh, align your organ energy, uh, calm your senses, do all the things I showed you in this chart. Because this chart uh, from this device shows you how strong your life force is. This is the basis of the life force that you need in order to create that life force engine and to create that success in your life and to create prosperity is based on this life force. So now we have the technology that can measure it and to show you exactly where you need to um, focus on, which organ is missing, lacking in energy, which part of your chakra is lacking, what you need to focus on. So I'm really excited about this and I hope that you're really excited about it too. And make sure you come to my webinar and we're gonna show you more about this technology. So until next time, use the force and prosper.